Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back to Let's Play Destiny Blind. I'm Shadow Dragonic and I'm joined again with Slow and his friend Malachi. So, we're gonna go ahead and continue doing strike things. So, I guess it doesn't really matter what you guys wanna do, right? It's just whatever. No. So, I guess we'll no, go ahead we and. Take um, on, uh, what are the burns this week? <clears throat> uh, in Heroic It's Art. All right, so I got the the bloated have... chalice. We haven't done that one yet, so. Okay, let's do it. Marky says. Yeah, but it's Ark in the heroics. This is these are just the the vanilla strikes. Oh, okay. So we don't you don't have to arc it for this. Case. Yeah, so I'm, I'm still a noob, so everything is going to be like really old to you guys. <laughs> uh, good times. Bring back, brings back a lot of memories, though, trust me. The Taken King is dead, yet still his armies writhe and claw at our We got wounds. some really fun memories in this Even game. Even <laughs> as you led the assault on the Dreadnought, a powerful Taken war beast fled for the safety of the shrine to Oryx. That's one of the reasons why I'm waiting for two, because once two comes out, I can pick that up right away, and you know, <laughs> I kind of yeah. start fresh. Yeah, I think it's gonna be pretty popular. I think a lot of people from this, uh, from the first one are definitely gonna pick it up. Mm -hmm. I guess now would be as good a time as any to uh, run my Zello. Yes, it'd be a great time to run it, actually. Let's get to work. So here we'll have these like little small waves of a bunch of ball and kind of a, like a night or wizard mini mini boss if you will. a yellow version of those. After we kill those, we'll see a uh, Like a, uh, uh, what's the word right? What are they called again? I'm sorry now? No, not, not chalice, but what are they called? Oh, t hus tomb husk or something like that? Tomb husk, yeah, right here. The side of you can come pick this up and then just uh, take it back up to the door. I know you've done, you've done this before, I've seen you do it on your uh, Let's Plays. Let's go have like two more rounds of this. Get that I need a 400 heavy so I can finally bump up my boo boo horn. Really? 
Yeah, I've seen that one now. Shadow, <clears throat> when this door just let unlocks. him run in. Just let him uh, run then, in. Yeah, immediately, places. immediately run in the door. Already, as soon as it opens, just go. <laughs> the dick. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. You tried to make me a distraction, but <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of one of those ride of passage things. I do I see uh, like jumping on that little ledge and getting blasted off? Oh my God, that like pissed me off. That, that pissed me off this, so bad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this that was kind of the same thing. So obviously, go right in can exude light wherever they go. Right. Just one of the agonies of their existence. Malak has begun to control that light, empowering it at his command. So, now we know. Get that wizard up there. Oh, yeah. Yep. Orbs over there for you, too. Mm -hmm. Yep. Close. I can sense the blight that drips and seethes within. How can she see this stuff with that whole blindfold thing? I see far better now than I ever did with my own eyes. next area of the shadow. Taking him out like Chris Kyle. <laughs> All right. 
Take him as you need him. Shadow in this your area. Um, we'll Do clear not these let few guys the lock dominate this shrine. Um, people generally will convene in the back left uh, for the fight. Back left. Yeah. You just follow. Follow us where we're going. The floor in here will kind of turn to poison. We'll take you down the floor so people can generally stay back in here. However. In this particular area, there's two taken phalanx to spawn back here on a regular basis. So you kind of have to be mindful. Yeah. And Malak, the boss guy, uh, every time he'll go into a different phase. So you gotta, once you shoot him in his head, like he'll he'll do different things. Like his attacks will be different. Like right now, he's just shooting with his gun. But once his head starts bubbling and bursting, his, uh, he'll change his tactics. Different things will happen. Uh, he'll change elements. Like yeah. right now he's throwing arc, so he's not now the next he's gonna be throwing uh so he's throwing, oh, he's throwing he's solar right now. This is really helpful when I can use you get into the strike playlist later on, uh, because when burns are in effect, his you'll really limit your exposure to whatever this is to. <laughs> in the bottom left, summon up to his aid, and his phalanx guy is spawn back here, so they're... It's real easy to get caught up sniping in the lock, and these guys will spawn up behind you and correct you. Watch out for those void things, uh, especially on the uh, void loot. You can't shoot them, by the way. Yeah, 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 I know. Okay. Yeah, it's on void week.
have held back the darkness, though the gods and princes of the hive hunger for our light. This is our charge, Guardian. <clears throat> now this strike this chest. Uh, is our fight. It's a hunter helmet. Is it a hunter or warlock? Hunter. Is it a hunter? It's a hunter helmet. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so this strike also got us later on to get skeleton keys. This will drop a strike unique uh, hunter helmet that will be at light level. Now, is that drop? Is that guaranteed every time? No. It's but it's it's one of about I think four, three or four things. So the odds are pretty good. Your percentage chance of getting it are, are pretty good. Um, I think this one drops this either the hunter helmet or the shadow touch shotgun. Oh, that's right. That's right. Yeah. All right. So what's up next? Oh, I haven't gotten that far yet. Okay. I think uh, I think that does it for yeah. Everything on the moon is done. So I guess next would be uh, Venus. We have looks like we only have one strike on Venus, uh, which is <coughs> the Nexus. Yeah. Okay. That's a that's a fun strike. <laughs> that's my favorite. Yeah, this is fun. Switch the hammer. Now, out of this particular strike chest, uh, you can get specific class items for well, I think it's for Titan mainly, um, and you can also get a hand cannon uh, called the Amago Loop out of this chest. Now the next and, is night, uh, Oh, no, no, it's not the Nexus. I was thinking, uh, 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 my bad. On this one, it's either a Warlock Helmet, or uh, the Daylight Dying Star, which is extremely cheesy, and then uh, the other one is a Titan Dish Rag. Do you need something, Kate? No. Just Yeah, we refer to Titan class armor as Dish Rags. They look like something you're hanging off your waist. That you just dry your hands on. <laughs> What strike was I thinking of, Robert? I thought it was the. Uh... You were thinking of uh, old Beardy. Um, yeah, but. Uh, yeah, that's the one that drops the Amago loop. Yeah, I know. I just I got the names Hold confused. On. I was thinking it was. Uh, I'm reading this... massive numbers of taken. It's an invasion. That's all right. Don't feel bad. You can't confuse me any more than I already am. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm sure we could actually. Trust me, we will. We will just to do it on purpose. Oh, I know. I know. <laughs> Atheon drops their necrochasm, just make sure you understand that. Yeah. <laughs> Where's Atheon, or whatever the speaker said in the trailer. Remember when the scholars said the Taken wouldn't be any trouble once we killed the king? Maybe they should grab a weapon and come out here. Their leadership has filtered downward. Take out the captains, Guardian. On this particular strike, on this taking taking strikes, it's almost worth building up your super before you come in here. Yeah. Uh, he's, he's, uh, he's not so tough. Even worse when you run across this. And it's, and it's, uh, this week is arc. Oh, it's terrible. I have my hammer still set up for PvP. Yep.
Delicious elves. Their forces here means they understand the value of the Nexus mind. If they've taken it, we can still blow it up. I'm reading a massive barrier ahead. Kate, I appreciate the support, but don't you have other responsibilities? Look, current situation aside, the Guardians have things handled. It doesn't leave a lot for the Hunter Vanguard to do. If you're bored, the Warlock Halls could always use a once-over with a mob. What was that? You're breaking up. Why Homer? Mm. All right, when you come out here, what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to grab this little uh, port where the marker is. You have to grab all that, and you're gonna have to take it across where that heavy ammo is. All right. Sounds like fun. Ball. Uh, yeah. Hopefully you want to clear out all the ads, obviously. Take care of these minotaurs. See ya. Alright. Okay. Grab that relic. Either you can stay up top. It, it does require somebody to be down here in the circle. So I'll stay down here if you want to take the higher ground, and we'll have a couple of waves of uh, a couple of guys. Coming. All right. Two couple. There's only one in the floor amongst them. Sure we'll Ghost. Got another wave coming up. Another wave coming up. All right. Now you can come down here. Pick up that heavy if you need it. Uh, I think I'm full on heavy. Okay. I need it. Then uh, we'll sit here in this thing uh, to let the circle build up. Then this big circle in front of us will go away. And we'll have a bunch of uh, little small vex that enemies that will come around the corner from our right. right. We'll have a dance I'm session. Sure. Take this. Yeah. yeah. That fear got you. Just waste these guys. Okay. You're super up, Robert, or no? No, I'm about three quarters of the way, man. Okay. Is, is um, yours up, Shadow? Yeah, mine's up. Yeah, his is up. I can see it. Okay, right, I'm going to take these guys coming come through here. I'm gonna, there's a bunch of guys over here. I'm going to take them out real quick. Doors. Well, yeah, that's they, disappointing, they, they man. Stay, oh, they stay back. Yeah, they didn't. Yeah, 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 <laughs> they didn't come yeah. forward like they normally do. Now mine's up. Yeah, because I'm all red. <laughs> We're all red barring. That's weird. Oh. Yeah. Ugh, am 
All right, we'll jump down jump here, like and depending on the version of the strike, you either have those little green, not green. Okay, we got minotaurs. So there's like five or six minotaurs we need to clear out. And then once we get rid of these guys, we'll have a big hydra that comes out in the middle of the thing. These Minotaurs in year one were nasty guys, man. Oh, I can imagine. Yeah, they were tough. Yeah, they were tough. We'll let you run the relic when it pops up, Shadow. Um, have you ever, I, take, I take it since you're so new, you've probably never played Vault nah, of Blast. No, nah, he's okay. never run any reds at all. I tried right, to so run it by myself. It didn't work too well. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so what you'll have to do is that the shield will come up and you'll have to pick it up. And you'll have and the super builds up extremely quick. So it's not like your super. You, yeah, your super. Your super off the shield will pick up really quick. And you'll and uh, the Nexus will have like this gate or shield around him. And you'll have to press L B and R B to uh bust down his shield yeah basically and, point at him and super yeah, like he would normally do yeah. and it'll shoot a thing at him and drop a shield and then we can put damage on him. actually this isn't that strike more. this it, is just no, a regular nexus strike so this is just shooting the eye yeah Oh yeah, Same okay. Normal. And when you're marked, come over here with me, Shadow, before you before you get blind. Get him in the light and it'll cleanse you. And you go okay. right back to where you were. This this happens in the Vault of Glass raid also. So if you do the Vault of Glass raid, if you will. Um, that is uh, the mechanic of that particular raid. But like sometimes the strike does it, sometimes it doesn't. There's a lot of enemies where you're at, buddy. Wow. <laughs> right, and you. down. Got, got him. Yeah, those, uh, <laughs> in that open area down there, Shadow, is where the enemies are spawned. So it's kind of best to not try to, try to not be caught down there in that area because uh, they get surrounded real quick. It's hard to get to survive there. It's going to be marked. Just shine a light over here. Yeah. I'm going to try to make this one if I can. Man down. Got you, got you, got you. He's almost dead. This is freaking hobgoblins, yeah, man. You. Yeah, this is. Uh, super. Okay. I didn't have it up. Yeah, there's different versions of strikes. Um, this was a little bit different version than what we used to. I think they think I'm too hands-on. 
you know. Some of them just don't like you. Wait, what? You've done well, Guardian. Now. For the time being, Venus continues to turn. We did. Despite our enemy's best efforts. What'd you think about that one? Ah, uh, it was. Well, I died, so I guess it was it was productive. <laughs> I say, if I die, it's productive. If you don't die, you're not putting out. So if you die, you're in the you're in the fight. That's good. And I'll be right back. holding you back on leveling up which particular piece of gear mine I don't really have a particular piece of gear <laughs> okay everything's pretty much well rounded pretty much okay I mean like I said I'm I'm still well I am very new to the game yet I mean I only got it like four months ago and I pretty much oh, just yeah. been, I've just been running, you know, campaign mode. The occasional strike and, um, like, Prison of Elders and stuff like that. Right on. Okay. Uh, PvP, and they got some pretty good drops now. It used to not be that way. It used to be a grind to get to 400. But, um, PvP levels you up pretty quick. I mean, I... I when I first jumped into the party, I heard you say that you're pretty uh, familiar with Call of Duty and stuff like that. And that's one that's one surefire way to get leveled up fairly quickly. Uh, the things that'll hold you back on PvP-wise will be your ghost and your artifact. But <clears throat> if you can pinpoint your strikes, say you're needing a primary. Like it looks like uh, with your Zalo, you're at 350. So you're needing a primary upgrade. Yeah. So what pretty I much, would do, pretty much all my, would do, all my weapons are pretty much 350 right now. So. Okay. So you're at 352 light. What I would do is go and run Dallas to Ark, which is a strike off of Mars. Um, he is guaranteed to drop just one thing only, and that is uh, the treads upon stars and an artifact. So if you need an artifact and you're needing a, a primary boost. For your light level, because that that'll that'll drop it at a higher light level than what you got, so you, it's almost a guaranteed boost. So which which strike was that? Uh, the Valistar strike on Mars. Is that one that's unlocked later? Because I'm not, I'm not uh, seeing that be, strike. It should be on Mars. Uh, you may not be. Have you beat the Vanilla Destiny yet? Yeah. Yeah. Mm, but it'll be. I'll have to look, man. Because the only the only strikes that I have, I have uh, the Undying Mind. I have uh, Cerberus V3. And Dust Palace. Those are the only three strikes that I have on Mars. Oh, sorry. It's I'm sorry. I was on mute. It's Cerebrus Vey. I was over talking to you guys. Oh, is it Cerebrus? Okay. Yeah, Cerebrus Vey 3. That's the name of the strike he's talking about. We call it yeah. Dust Arc just because that's the, that's the boss's name at the end of it. So, but yeah, Cerebrus Vey. Sorry, Bay, man. Uh, Vet lingo. Vet third. lingo. <laughs> no, it's all good. <laughs> like I said, you can't, you can't confuse me any more than I already am, so... Yeah, if you click on that one and, and go to the hard mode version of it, I believe that uh, that's where that uh, treads upon stars and uh, ghost will drop. It's only on hard mode. Was it you say ghost or artifact? Yeah, I don't yeah, think it drops. Yeah, because you gotta have the chest. The you one. gotta have the chest populate. And it yeah. won't populate unless uh, you're on the hard mode. Yeah, because I don't have hard yeah, mode unlocked set it, yet. Said it's a hard. Oh, you don't. Oh, no, I've only well, got normal. The strike then. Have you have you run the strike at all? Um. Yeah, I think I ran the strike. Um, just uh, is it blue? No, no, it's not blue. It's uh, 
Is it just is it just like hollow, whatever? Not highlighted? Yeah, it's not highlighted. Okay, then you haven't run it yet. Oh, I haven't let's run it yet. That. Okay. No. Oh. Yeah, let's do that. All right. I'll run and it on. I'll run it on normal. You have to then. run the. Uh, there you go. Yeah, you have to run it on normal first before the other one unlocks. All right. Yeah, but the second one is where you go in, and that's where uh, that chest is uh, available. So you guys want to run this one twice then, if it'll unlock hard mode? Hell yeah. It, yes, but, 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 you need to have a skeleton key. You can't open these chests without a skeleton key. All right. So uh, the only way I know to get skeleton keys Whether is running through the SIVA Crisis Hero playlist, but I don't know if you have that unlocked or not. I think I do. Um, I might. I don't know. If you do, if you... When you go to your, uh, if you're in orbit, you go to your destination from what I can get, screen, he commands look the on the bottom left, and you'll see a bunch of just you know, random little pictures, not really pictures, they're uh, highlightable team, events, those activities down there. And, and if you have the SIVA Crisis Heroic, then jump into that playlist. It'll be us three, and we'll be able to handle anything that, that, that comes our way. We, you know, we'll be able to help you out, but there's a lot of XP to be had from there. As well as all the chests, skeleton keys, you know, eligible for exotic drops, for free corn, all that kind of good stuff. Let's find access to their system. See if we can track Ooh, down. Ooh, public Dallas event. Yeah, let's do this. Do it. What is it? What's the? Uh... No, no, oh. no, no. Oh, okay. Okay. Sort of target down. What's up, buddy? Public events usually pay off pretty good, and you usually get uh, lots of a few engrams out of them and XP. Stuff like that, so whenever you're in a, in a public area like this, and there's one going on, it's pretty good idea to, to uh, jump in on it. Oh, yeah. Great work. Oh, yeah. There you go. Got some goodies out of that, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, got some decent stuff. And the, the legendaries, they cap out at hey, 385, I believe, don't they? I think so, yeah. Do you have any three of coins, mm -hmm. uh, Shadow? Yeah, yeah, I, I popped one before we killed him, so. Okay. Okay, see if it's still active. I don't know if that it works on those guys. Yeah, yeah, it, I think it does. Does it? Okay. If it's if it's still in place right now, then that means it that guy didn't count for it. How do you how do you, you tell if it's in place? place? Open your menu, which shows your character, and right beneath your level on your left hand side, underneath your grimoire score, you'll see a little triangle with the. Uh, oh, okay, it says Roman exotic in exotic it. particles. Yes. Okay. Do okay, you, so it's still it active. Place? Do you have? Right, so that means that it it doesn't work on that on those public event guys. Okay. It's only going to work at like. The end of strike bosses and and the bosses that you've been working on on the the taken guys like when you said you went to mars and stuff like that yeah those guys those guys will work okay but the good news is you still have it active and ready so when we kill this guy here in a second you'll be eligible for a uh, drop this way kiddo and if he doesn't if he doesn't drop anything it'll stack for the next one And running, going through strike playlists is a very good way to get strange coins as well. So if you're short on strange coins, which you need to buy three coins, uh, running strikes is a really good way to uh, accumulate those. All right. As usual, you're here and kill stuff. Watch out to your left because there's going to be a, a, a colossus over here. Thank <laughs> you. 
Wow, I threw a grenade at this door up here, and it went through the door. <laughs> Way to go, Bungie. Oh, that never happens. Oh my god, somebody <laughs> died besides me? Yeah, look at this noob. Look at this noob shadow. Yeah, you know, we really need to find more reliable players, shadow. I'm just telling guy. you. I don't know. I've been trying to tell you that for years. <laughs> Special ammo down here. Um, I'm actually pretty good. I'm only too short, okay. so. Alright, well, I'm not gonna take it anyway. We're leaving this area anyway, so we might as well pull it. I'm about out of primary ammo, though. Oh, you'll get some more in just a second. Uh, in this track, there are drivable vehicles that are weaponized. Um, some people do, most people don't, but if you ever feel the need to, you can get one of these things and drive around. And That's one thing I wish they would have added, like, being able to get your own, you know, drivable vehicle with weapons. Right, yeah. There's one here, and then uh, there's also another one uh, on Venus, another track on Venus where... Uh, you can uh, get a vehicle called a, a pike, and it's weaponized. It's kind of like a sparrow, but it's uh, it has guns. Put your ghost up here. Everybody has their own way of doing this particular strike. You can, you can stay up here. Uh, I like to get on top of this building personally. Uh, because sometimes you'll have guys spawn actually inside this area. Uh, it's not really a particularly always safe space. <laughs> right. Also, of course, different versions of this strike as well. So, uh, sometimes taken, sometimes not. There's some orbs over here. To, There's quite a few. Yeah, yeah I'm super. Yeah, I don't know why I got it I know. It's embarrassing. Man. God bless. Well, they were standing side by side, but I don't know why they kill a second. Oh, man, these okay. guys are dropping so lots of heavy ammo. Good. Oh, that's a good thing. Now we may either, either have, to, have to investigate the anomaly or kill a tank. Okay, uh, almost always guaranteed to drop one. Uh, okay, if you just stay back here with Malachi, I'm going to run forward. Uh, just so you know, at this little thing, just sparrow across it. 
Just come over here, kiddo. Most people, All right, most I'm people on my way. will sparrow across it and come back. I like to go across it and stay back here because I have a pretty good little fighting position for this guy. And I like to be right here, but you have a hobgoblin that'll pop up behind us every once in a while. Yeah, this is a three coin eligible guy, like you were saying, also. So, if you're if he doesn't drop one after this kill, after we kill this guy, drop another one if you have it um, for the uh, for the final boss. You remember uh, your Black Guard mission, where you had to kill those three giant minotaurs? Yeah, yeah. This is like the updated version of one of those guys. I'll take this shield guy out of here. Okay. Guys running all over the place. A lot right. more than normal. Oh yeah. yeah. I Keep see it. Oh yeah. <laughs> he always I tell you what, man, every single time he always drops it. Lucky. Lucky man. Oh, so. but I'm full up. Anyway, so if you have an, an exotic uh, if you have a three of coin to use, now would be a good time. Uh, if you have one to spare, that is. I know you don't have very many of them, but um, anytime you're running strikes, it's always good to have one act active. Yeah, I got two left, so it's all good. Okay. All right, I'm gonna sparrow up. Robert, you recognize this old beast, this old sparrow here? That's a holy moly. <laughs> that pile out of the ask <laughs> been there for probably a year <laughs> we're right back guys we're good shadow we keep going all right now this area right here um, you can stay and fight I wouldn't recommend it most people fly through it um, so I usually fly to a little point up here and we'll kind of sparrow up up this ramp up here. Once I get up here, there we go. I'll turn left. Sometimes people will uh, they'll want to go through and fight that whole area, but I find it to be pretty redundant. You don't really need anything. It's a uh, one of those general uh, population public areas. You'll find people in there sometimes. Clear the room. You'll see right here behind you to your right or in front of you, there's this little white ring right here. Yeah. Uh, you can deploy a little beacon thing and it'll put out like a big machine gun that you can climb into. Um, again, some people do, most people don't. Uh, because it kind of puts you in a, in a uh, single position and that they can just, just lay on. Shadow, do you need the heavy or are you full? Um, no, I'm full. I'm good. Okay. Oh, another little piece of advice about this strike. If you are ever in here and then all of a sudden you just go ahead and run out to the main room, all the enemies that were in this room will be pulled out to here. Just for future reference. 
So that's why it's a good idea to go ahead and just wipe out what you had in there. Now generally, uh, Shadow, there's different approaches people take to this. I personally like to stay up here on this upper right hand area because there's cover and you have high ground. Uh, some people will fight over there on the far side from the upper part of the left. Everybody has a place to do it. I'll stay down yeah. here towards the back because it just feels good. Yeah, try to stay close to cover because if this guy locks onto you with his rockets like that or uh, his machine gun, then he'll take you down real fast. Yeah, my super didn't kill him. Uh, <laughs> oh, well. That's alright. There we go. Gotcha. Uh, no exotics. Uh, I didn't even get a legendary. Not sure. Yeah. Legendaries won't very commonly drop. But in the darkness lights, more suits will come. Do you have a skeleton key or no? No, no, I don't have a skeleton key. He doesn't. I didn't think the chest would spawn in here, but I guess so. Well, anyway, now you should have hard mode unlocked for uh, for this. But it's nice to know you don't have to run the hard mode to get the chest. Right. Still need skeleton keys, though. So. Yeah. Once we get through here, we get back to orbit. Uh, I haven't looked yet. Uh, look at your director and see if you have those Siva Crisis Heroic um, Strikes unlocked. If you do, let's jump into those, into that, because we'll be able to, to back you up through whatever we come across. And uh, and you'll be able to get uh, some skeleton keys. That'll help you uh, level up. Or get your light up. Uh, I'll look up the Nightfall, Robert. See what it is. Let's see. Fresh Troops, Match Game, Catapult, Exposure. Yeah, let's run through the nightfall, man. It's 380. You're we can crazy, get dude. It. Dude, we can do it, man. <laughs> wait a Come minute, on, wait a man. Minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Let me see who it is first. I think it's Vallis, man. Or no, that was last week, wasn't it? Yeah, that was last you, week. Early you see before. what it is. Yes, I, I do have the Siva Crisis jealous. Heroic. Okay, let's at least do that playlist. I don't recommend doing the nightfall because our buddy here, our friend, is suicidal. Uh, no, it's, man. It's Tanix. It's <laughs> oh, even it's better. We, can, we got it. We got it, man. We, <laughs> we, 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 can, we can carry him. Let's get him higher before we go through a nightfall. Now, now here, here's a question. Is a skeleton key okay. is a skeleton key guaranteed to receive a crisis or no? No. No. Okay. But it will it will drop in the crisis. Now, where it is guaranteed is if you complete it's a nightfall. It's right. a nightfall. Right. right. I'm 100% right. confident we can carry him through tanks. Well, I think what I'm going to do, though, is <laughs> this episode has run about an hour, so I'm going to end this episode. And I think what we can do is I'll we can try and uh, get myself a skeleton key off camera. And then, um, okay. I don't know, I guess we'll go from there then. Okay. <laughs> All right. Good. Yeah! All Back right. in the game.
so thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed this episode or previous episodes, please give it a like. If you guys enjoy my Let's Plays, please don't hesitate to, to subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next episode of Let's Play Destiny Blind. But until then, guys, later.